if you go out and you meet five people from different households in the morning, you being the sixth person, you then go and do the same in the afternoon and the same in the evening, you can see how the number of additional contacts that are potentially possible will just rack up. So people have got to be sensible and proportionate with the freedom that you know, we've absolutely wanted to give to people because we need to see loved ones. And if people go further and think, oh, it just won't matter, you know, I'll just go a little further with the measures that have been announced, then this won't work either. This virus, as I said last time I was at the podium, has a natural R of three. One case will infect three more people. It's like having a spring in a box and you've got the lid on. Now, you can take the lid off a little, but you haven't disconnected the spring or broken the spring in any way. If you take the lid right off, the spring's still under tension, off it will go again. And so this is a dual responsibility here of government to go slowly and carefully and to take the advice from the scientists, of the scientists to watch this whole thing very closely over the next few weeks, and of the public in general to actually follow the guidance, don't tear the pants out of it, and don't go further than the guidance actually says.